The palace said the reports Meghan, 37, was interested in taking up postnatal confinement after her mother Doria Raglan sent her a book about it are categorically untrue. The denial comes after claims the new mother had become intrigued by the Chinese practice after she read the book The First 40 Days, The Essential Art of Nourishing the New Mother. The book suggests new mothers hibernate for 30 days, with bans on visitors and interactions with the outside world. A source told The Sun, Doria had been speaking to Meghan constantly throughout her pregnancy and couldn't have been more supportive. She was recommended this book, read it, and then sent it to Meghan who said it had become her Bible. She wants to adopt the key principles and as much as her royal status allows. Obviously she cannot shut herself off completely from the outside world but she and Prince Harry are in agreement that her visitors in the first two weeks will be family members only. The practice of confinement is said to be widely adopted in Asia. The news comes after a royal biographer warned Meghan Markle she would lose any battle with Buckingham Palace over her maverick ways and seeming disregard for time-honored royal codes. Royal biographer Angela Levin said that the royals will win any clash between Meghan and them. Former Suits actress Meghan Markle has been accused of running their own publicity machine and disobeying the palace since she entered the family. But Angela Levin said, Meghan is beautiful, intelligent and ambitious, and intent on proving these qualities to the world, even at the risk of anchoring the palace establishment. As we shall see, there may be storm clouds ahead. I can reveal that Buckingham Palace, unsettled by Meghan's determination to do things her own way, has already taken decisive action to control her activity. Harry and Meghan's firstborn son was born on May 6. Two days later his name, Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, was publicly announced. The new royal baby is currently seventh in line to the throne, right behind his father. He holds both UK and US nationality, collecting the latter via his mother.